Uh, looks like this afternoon about 3.52, we got a shot spotter notification of a possible shooting in Veterans Park at 14th and Broadway. Responded here, found two parties that were shot inside the park here. Uh, they were both transported to the hospital. There was also another walk-in individual at the hospital as well. We believe that's also related to this. Subsequently, one of the individuals that was taken to the hospital was pronounced dead. So we have two parties that were shot that are alive and one that was pronounced at the hospital. Do you think it was some sort of skirmish in the homeless camp? Or we don't know what led up to this at this point in time. We're still talking to numerous individuals. We're getting conflicting uh, statements about suspects. So once you get a chance to get everybody down, talk with them, we hope we discern a little bit more about what happened. Any right idea now, how many suspects, Sonny? Uh, right, well, we did, no, we don't know that. Right? I do know we were getting at least one, obviously. But as far as the descriptions, we're trying to narrow that down before we put anything out. Genders? Uh, all, all adult males. Any cooperation from the folks here? Is there uh, they, we're not getting any resistance, but we're just having to work at this a little bit and give people talk, and then we'll uh, basically take the time and talk with them and see what we come up with. Just because of discussions today, can you describe the nature of your duties here in the state land? Well, anytime there's a crime of an homicide, it's, it's, it's inside of the city, county, city, county of Denver. It is ours to investigate. What about the camping? I can't. That's, as far as that, I, I can't even get into that right now. That's a whole other issue. To be clear, was it near like the walkway within the park? And what are we talking, are we talking well, about? Well, basically, um, we know it's on this end, basically on the south end of the park here, okay. is our understanding. Any uh, fear, uh, you know, bullets flying outside toward vehicle traffic? Anybody else walking on the sidewalk? Or? We're, that's We're all trying to figure that out at this point in time as far as suspect information, suspect vehicle, any of that. We don't have that right now. We're still talking to people. As you know, this just happened. 352. So we're talking to witnesses, trying to discern exactly what did transpire. Was there anybody fleeing the scene that we have information on? So we're following up on leads as they come in, and we've been following up on this since you guys have been here. But right now, we don't have anything to come with now. The two additional, the two additional men that were shot. I know one's dead. Anything on their condition right now? Um, we're going to say critical, uh, but that's always what we're going to say until we know more. Okay. Right. Uh, the area, the immediate area has been cleared out, obviously, so we can do our investigation. We'll get in here as quick as we, quick as we can, gather as much information as we can, but we, we get one shot at that, so we got to take the time and do it right. And the two, watching, two were transported by ambulance, right? The uh, yes, two. two, yeah, and then there was one as a walk-in. Denver Health? Yes, sir. Um, you have a lot of vehicle traffic, of course. People don't know what's going on. Is there an overriding method you want to get to people? Or well, just understand there's going to be delays in traffic going up 14th Avenue for a significant amount of time. So we do need to keep this area clear so we can get cars in and out. Sonny, you put people together in a camp right now under the circumstances that have become more pressure, the, the entire circumstances of people living here, do you believe that has anything to do with what you You don't know. I mean, that's a good question. I mean, obviously, you know, we can speculate on a lot of things, but I don't want to do that because I could be totally wrong. So uh, we're going to just basically get in here, see what we can find out, talk to as many witnesses as we can that were here at the time. Hopefully they can give us good information as to who did this, and we can make a, and then we can affect the rest of it. That third, that third person again, how were they? You said there were two that were in the park, and the third person, can you explain that again? Went on, the, went, uh, basically was a walk in at the hospital. Okay. Yeah, okay. how they got there, we still need to look at all that. But hopefully, they can give us good information as to what, what did transpire. You probably don't know a long time No, at this point in time, we don't know. Until we get a chance to find out who the suspect is, that's still, we're, we're going to use everything we can to determine that, but we're still so early in this. Guys? Okay. Thanks, Sonny. Thanks, guys.